Hi, my name is Derek Su, Executive Coding Officer for Kite, and welcome back to the Free Kite Python course. Here on Kite, we're on a mission to spread knowledge of new technologies around the world. Today, we're going to continue learning about lists. So let's look at some list operations. So first, the plus sign combines a list. So if you have two lists, you can combine their contents using the plus sign. And you can also multiply a list. So whatever is inside of a list, you can multiply it by a certain number and the contents of that list will repeat itself for that number of times. So let's look at an example in the text editor. So let's say that I have a list that we'll call list. And let's say it just contains ABC. We can add to this list. So let's say I want to make a new list. We can add to this list by saying plus um, D, E, and F. So if we print new list, it will simply just be these two lists um, combined into one list. So you can see it's just A, B, C, D, E, F. And we can also multiply a list. So let's say we want A, B, C repeated three times. We can say list times three. And if we print new list, it will be ABC repeated three times. If you remember from our previous lesson, we learned that we can slice strings to get a certain part of a string. And you can do the same thing with lists. So here we have a list T. You can slice from index 1 to index 3. And 3 is exclusive, which is why we get BC. And remember that if we omit the first index, it starts at the beginning. And if we omit the last index, the slice will just go to the end. And since lists are mutable, we can also take a slice and then change the contents of that slice, which will in turn change the contents of the list. So let's look at this in the text editor. So I'm going to start by making a list. And I'm just going to call it list. And it's going to contain a few numbers and also a couple of letters. So if we want to slice this list, we can say that we want this list sliced from 2 to 4. And we're going to print it. And what this will print is that it will print the portion of the list starting at index 2, which is 3, and ending at index 4, which is B. And B is exclusive, so we should just get 3A. And we can also just remove the first index, which means that we want the list starting at the beginning to index 4. Or we can also remove the last index, which means we want from index 2 to the end. And remember that lists are also mutable, so we can actually slice a portion of the list and change it. So if we wanted this list to only contain numbers, saying 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, getting rid of AB, we could say that list slice from index 3 to index 5, which contains that portion of the list, we could say that that equals 4, 5. And that essentially replaces AB. So if we want to print this list now, uh, we can see that AB has been replaced and is now 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Thank you for listening to today's Python lecture about lists. If you have any questions, join our Discord server, link below. There you will have complete access to forums where Kite representatives can answer questions about concerns or confusions on exercises. Also, make sure to follow our new Instagram and Facebook accounts for Kite updates. Have a great day.